Hello loves, welcome back. Today I'm coming to you guys with my Ipsy Glam Bag Unbagging. Now, I know I'm coming to you guys at the end of the month and I have a few more videos that are lined up that are coming up from subscription services. So you're gonna see the same face, the same shirt, yada, yada, yada. I took a peek in there, but I did not fiddle with anything. So I got some goodies in here. The first thing I noticed was a Julie G nail color. I just don't want nail polish. I just, I'm, <laughs> I have specified a million times before that I do not like nail polishes in my Ipsy Glam Bag. And for some reason, I guess this month they decided to send me one. Um, this does come with a dollar off Rite Aid coupon for any Jessie's Girl or Julie G product. So I will take advantage of this dollar off coupon and probably stock up on some Jessie's Girl um, liquid eyeliner which is my favorite for the summertime so yeah I mean this is a really cute pink but this is not something that I'm going to be using so I would just give this away to somebody again they could have just given me something else I could utilize like skincare but no so the next thing I see here is from oh it's from the balm and this is a cute little packaging it's the new dude volume 2 Ooh, and it's the eyeshadow it's an eyeshadow and it shows you all the colors here I got the shade fit I'm gonna go ahead and this looks like a color I would use and I like the balm products so yes that's the color right there Ooh. very pretty traditional champagne -y gold color okay let's see here let's dig in here so the next thing I see here is a cute little tin, and it is all natural tinted lip and cheek balm. Oh my god, it's written so small. It's from Mullen and Sparrow. And, oh, that's really dark. Ooh. Uh, this smells funny. Um, let's see if I can get the scent. Yeah, it's it says it has oils of patchouli and orange. Everything's organic. It's got shea butter, uh, alkanet root, cocoa butter, extra virgin olive oil. This is a strange mix. It's not gross, but... Ooh. I mean, I might use this for the lips, but there's not much tint to it. So I don't know how this could be a leap, a leap, a lip or cheek tint. I mean, it really, it literally, this is where I swatched it. It literally leaves nothing. This is more, ugh, it looks oily now. <laughs> this is more for lips. I'm going to take it as that. So the fourth thing I see comes in this uh, cute little box, and it's called Pandora's Blush. And so it's just going to open it up. Cool, cool. It comes in a pan. This is Pink Carnation, and this is a blush, obviously. And... It's really pretty. I'm gonna go ahead and swatch it with a clean finger. Ooh, that is uh, pretty pigmented there. So my hand's still a little wet from cleaning the swatches off, but that's it right there. A little bit probably will go a long way for my face, but this is a really pretty. It's like a peach but pink. It's it is a carnation color. It's really pretty. The fifth and final thing is from Mica Beauty Cosmetics. And what is this? It is an eye primer. Oh, okay. We can dig it. So this is the eye primer. I know they sent me an email. I think about this. I'm going to go ahead and take from the side here. With my nail. This feels, you can see it right there. It feels very, very thick. It looks very similar to Painterly Paint Pot. Can't wait to give it a go. I love primers for the eyes, especially because I need a lot of neutralizing on these sallow lids. So that's pretty much it for my Ipsy Glam Bag. I actually like it. Um, I could do without the nail polish. I'm a little disappointed in that because I think I try to keep up with um, the products that I do and don't like. But whatever, that's neither here nor there. That's just something else that I can give to someone. So I don't mind gifting these out. So anyway, guys, I hope you guys like this video. Please thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And as always, I'll see you guys in my next video. Love you guys. Bye.